Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. So today it is freaking cold out here, man. It's 40 degrees, 45, 48 degrees. I think the high is going to touch up in the mid 50s. But the plan today is to sight cast some redfish, man. It's been a little while since I've been able to sight cast some redfish. So that's what I really want to do because I want to feel that fight from those brutal, brutal strength of those redfish, if you guys know what I'm talking about. But yeah, I'm in the back lake, in the back marsh. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to work the shoreline and push pull myself through the shallows and work myself through the oyster beds and hopefully I can run into some redfish and I'll also be looking out for some birds. They will tell me the way hopefully. So yeah, you guys stay tuned. Man, at times like these, I wish I had a Star, Star Trek teleporting machine. I can get to my destination so much faster <laughs> and avoid all this shallow water. But sometimes, that's just the way it is, man, when you fish. Shallow water, oyster bed, adversity, <laughs> line break-offs, all the bad luck that happens, man. That's just part of fishing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we got our first working pod of birds right there I'm not sure they're just kind of hovering over the water making me think that's a possibility there could be a school of reds there all right I got my rod and reel ready okay my drag is set golly man they just these birds just split to over there now come on birds make up your mind <laughs> Oh no, don't break up. Come on, stay intact. I'm almost there. I'm about, I would say 175 yards out. Almost there. Yeah, that's gotta be a school of redfish, I believe. How they're just hanging on top of the water really low. One, two, three, four, five, six, about 12 birds. And more seagulls are coming. Right there. Nope, missed them again. There we go, got him. <laughs> yeah, redfish, redfish, redfish. There they go. They're breaking up. Nice. <laughs> oh, yes, baby. Thank you, birds. Thank you, my drones. I love drones. <laughs> oh, nice red. All right, guys. First, redfish sight casted him using birds as my drone. He's a nice big fella here. Beautiful fish, man. Check it out, dude. On the uh, Trout Thumper by Bugs Fishing Lures. Check that out, man. Beautiful, beautiful fish. I had him barely hooked. Check that out, dude. But I'll take him anyways. Oh, yeah, buddy. Plan is working out pretty good, man. Sight casting. It's happening. It's happening. Hopefully, we can keep the momentum. He's at 23 and 3 quarters. Thank you. Thank you, dude, for giving yourself away. I do appreciate it. Tell your buddies that I'm not here. And then I'm coming for you guys, hopefully. <laughs> uh, All right. After waiting for about 15 minutes, I see another pot of birds over there. Let's see what they're working at. Looks like another school redfish, how the seagulls are just kind of hovering over the water. So let's go check it out. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they, my friend? Where'd they go, buddy? Where'd they go? Where'd they go? Oh, there they are. There we go. <laughs> uh, he's a smaller guy. Is he on? Is he on? I lost him. I lost him. He spit the hook. 
He spit the hook. He spit the hook, folks. There we, oh, dude, I had him again. God, man, my hoagie bug. I think the, uh, the, uh, whatchamacallit is getting away. The weed guard. Might have to, I'm going to have to cut that off. He's here somewhere, though. He's here. Now he's gone. <laughs> so much fun. Okay, some more birds here. Just one though, I don't know. Sometimes it only takes one bird though. Oh, right there, redfish, redfish, redfish. I saw him with my own eyes. There we go, got him. Yep. Oh, uh, what is this, a trout? This feels like a trout. Feels like a trout. No, it's a red, gotta be a red. <laughs> All right. Tighten up the drag a little bit. This is a little bigger dude. All right, line, don't break, man. I'm using ultralight stuff. I need to change it out. Yeah, it's a big red. It's a big red. He's a big red. And I'm not talking about the gum. Oh. <laughs> nice redfish, boy. Come on in here, dude. I'm gonna let you go. I just want to take a quick pick, bro. Real quick pick. And then we'll call it. We'll call it even, all right? Here you go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, nice, man. Thank you, bird. Once again, brother, I appreciate the effort and the help and the aid. Check out this big fella right here, man. He's going to be bigger than the first one I ca just caught. Just out of curiosity how big you are. I know these are all slot. This guy is at six and a half pounds. Nice big redfish. Once again, man, on the... On the trout thumper, doing the work, man. Just side casting it, throwing it. Had some birds that are working, and he's drumming hard. He's like, dude, that hoagie bug is so good. <laughs> All right, brother. Thank you so much for the fight there, bro. I appreciate it. Beautiful blue tail there. Oh, wow. That feels so, so good. Mm-mm-mm. This is what I'm using, guys. This is a Bugs Fishing Lure Trout Thumper. I'm not sure what colorway this is, but it's dark. It came with a chartreuse tail, but I put my own Hoagie's swimming jack on it, and it's worked pretty good. It has a big um, weed guard. However, the area that I'm fishing at has no weeds, so I tore it off because I lost a couple fish already because of that weed guard blocking that hook. But otherwise, pretty cool lure. Use the sight cast. Uh, this is a really good lure to use in the wintertime. All right, we got some birds working here. That looks like seagulls in a mix of uh, terns. Got some, looks like terns over there. Uh, looks like they're just working bait, perhaps. Doesn't look like it's a school of reds, but I'm gonna check this one. I'm closer right here. Let's see what this is going on right here. I got the sunlight right in my face. It's hard to see with that glare. I think that might be a couple reds. This bird is. Well, maybe it was, maybe it wasn't, I don't know. Oh, there we go. No, it was a redfish. It was a redfish. Oh, he spit it. Dang it, dude. Golly. All right. Let's check out. Let's check out what these turns are doing right here. Little biggie bait fish. That's, that's what they're hitting on. Oh, no, it's a redfish. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> He's chasing one red. Oh man, I guess that's my limit folks. Oh <laughs> uh, well, there you go man. You just never know when you think it's just bait fish, the predatory fish are right around the corner. Alright, I don't think I have this guy hooked on pretty good. He's a pretty strong dude too. Oh, let's not lose this guy Nick. He's taking me for a circle ride. <laughs> man, these old 18 rods man, they're so accurate, so light, so strong. And we're able to hook these big old monsters, man. Come on, brother. Make sure I keep that tension tight so he doesn't spit that hook. There he is. There he is. There he is. All right, this guy. Ooh, this guy is, he's gonna be the biggest one today for sure, folks. I just don't want him to cut my thin line there. He's going right under my boat everywhere. Yeah, he's a, this is a big dude. This is gonna be probably about seven, Maybe touching eight pounds. Oh, getting the net there, boy. Woo -hoo -hoo. 
yeah, let's go, boy. Woo! Check out this brute of a redfish, man. Wow, he got some cuts on him too. Big, big boy with a lot of sea lice on him. Gross. Big dude. And look at that. Taking that hokey baits, that trout thumper, hole in his mouth, man. I actually cut down the, the trailer end of that hoagies because it was too long and I missed a couple. But that is a big redfish. Let me see how big you are, dude. This guy is eight pound. Eight pound redfish per boga. Big, healthy. This is a nice tournament redfish for sure, man. Once again, caught him on the uh, trout thumper. And that's it, guys. I'm done with my fishing. Mission accomplished, man. It feels so good to knock it out fast, man. I'm just going to have a lot of fun. And there you go, man. So winter fishing, man, it's a great time to sight cast because the water is clear. There's a lot of bait activity, even though the water is a little bit cold. But if it gets, when it gets colder, it's going to die down. But right now is the optimal time to chase birds, man. Birds are working in these back lakes, in these back marshes. Any marsh, man, no matter what spot you're at, there's going to be birds, there's going to be redfish, and they're going to be hunting, man. But that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, and comment on the video. Let me know what you think. And once again, man, I appreciate every guy, every single one of you guys that watch the video and click on the thumbnail to play the video. Yeah, that's going to be it, man. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Hey.